Welcome back. It is time for Tasty Tuesday. Melinda Shekels, a lifestyle and entertainment expert and editor of OnTheStrip.com as well as OffTheStrip.com is joining us. I just love the cash. I'm so comfortable right <laughs> He's We're ready. talking about food. He's ready to it's talk about food. It's so great to get both of you oh, right. today. Yeah. I'm, I'm really excited by that. So we can talk about, I know you guys love to eat. So of course. We, we really do. Uh, that's all we talk about every you. single day. I'm ready. Make room. <laughs> Wait, so we want to talk about the first place. Thank you so much for being uh, with us, of course. Uh, first spot here, Martha Stewart. Uh, restaurant, the Bedford, the right? Bedford. So tell us a little bit about this and, and the prices. We want to touch on the prices too. Oh yeah. So I had an opportunity over the weekend to attend the opening of the Bedford, which was quite spectacular as we would imagine with Martha and all of her friends, including First name basis. First name basis. I love it. <laughs> showed up to greet her. And I got to tell you, I was over, you know, overseeing what was going on there and checking around if there were cameras and there weren't and their relationship is really genuine nice. from what I saw. They look like two old friends catching up <laughs> and they just obviously have a lot of great camaraderie for each other. Now, I get there. They, they are. are. <laughs> love it. Okay. Martha, Martha told me she drinks Casa Dragonis tequila with fresh pomegranate juice. So you got to imagine everything's fresh, mm -hmm. right? From her cocktails to her chicken. Now, this chicken dish is 90 dollars so there is it's a very extravagant spot the bedford at paris you can definitely expect a range of prices there um and oysters rockefeller definitely a splurge for a night out <laughs> but you know what it, and it, martha's using it like a showroom too because it's got her pots and pans collection her cookbook oh, collection wow. so you got to think she's got all the merch there too martha's a very smart businesswoman she is indeed. i want to okay. keep that picture up with her <laughs> and Snoop Dogg. i love it Absolutely. Right? but if we're looking for something a little more affordable you also have roses and that's italian rosa Restaurante on St. Rose. Now I've talked about their dinners before. We've chatted about that when they opened a few months ago. They're now doing brunch and they're actually doing breakfast from 10 to noon okay. on Saturday and Sunday. And then they're carrying it into brunch from 12 to four. Look at this. Now these prices are much more affordable. They really range, you know, in the $20 price range, average, you know, normal brunch prices sure. for a local restaurant. You get some fantastic food there. The salmon crostini. Yeah. Oh, that looks good. Amazing. The eggs benedict, the lemon ricotta pancakes with blueberry compote, which I loved. Um, and then you can also stay for their happy hour, which starts at three, and it's called the Perfect Ten, and it's a ten dollar happy hour. And that's an oh, that early happy great. hour, three o'clock, yeah. yeah. and Saturday and Sunday I too, which it. is super awesome. Nice. Plus, I'm a sucker for pancakes, so you got me when you showed that first picture. <laughs> yeah, lot of sweet, lot of savory. Okay. Now, if you want a very special pop-up dining experience, I had the opportunity to do this over the weekend. The Lodge at Mount Charleston is doing a dinner series, a dinner and a weekend dinner series. So they'll do a Saturday and a Sunday. They just announced their next round, which will start Labor Day weekend. You go on Ticket Sauce, get your tickets. <laughs> they're going to have, so they're having like a big pizza throwdown with some of the biggest, the city's best pizza makers. Mm. That'll be Labor Day weekend, Saturday okay. and Sunday. Then they're going to be doing Chef Todd English will be there as Ooh. well the following weekend, which is really cool. Mm -hmm. And um, Gina Marinelli from La Strega will also be there wow. um, as well. So there's, check this out. Ellis, go to Ellis Island. It's their property, the Lodge of Mount Charleston, obviously. It burned down last year, but right. this is how they're using the space, which is so cool. And there's a lot of people that reacted to this when it first came out yeah. saying, this is so great. We can finally go up there, bring people together in a spot that they're familiar with. And, and it's 20 enjoy. degrees cooler. <laughs> and exactly. this That's is, the best part. There's open bar, so there is a shuttle that you can take, and it's great. So, so let somebody else do the driving. So safe. many options. We've talked about in Good Morning it. Las Vegas as well. So yeah, lots yeah. of things to do for you. Uh, make sure you stay with us because we'll have much more coming up right after this break.